The Canon EF 100mm f2.8 L Macro IS USM. This new lens replaced the previous very popular 100mm f2.8 uh, macro lens from Canon. Not only is it very good for macro shooting but also very popular for portrait usage as well. The new lens is more than just an improvement with the L branding. The optics has been improved but most important you would see the new hybrid IS system which features up to four stop correction, a first in any of the macro lens in the EOS series. With macro shooting at one times magnification, you can actually achieve up to two stops of correction for angular movements, which is often a very problematic issue when shooting hands-free. You get the lens case LP1219 and the lens hood, the ET73 as well. On the side of the lens, you have three controls. To start with, of course, you have your stabilizer on off. For situations where you're running off the tripod, you may save some power by switching it to off, or when you're using handheld mode, obviously, to keep it on. As well as autofocus or manual focus, this is, of course, very common. Finally, it's the selection of the focusing range. In normal situations where you may not know what you may be shooting at the next moment, having it on full will allow you to focus through the full range of the lens. However, if you're using it for specific applications, by limiting it, you will actually benefit from faster focusing. And you have two options for this, either the 0.5 meter to infinity range or the 0.3 to 0.5 meter range where you would spend most of your time when you're doing serious macro work. When we knew that there was a, a new 100mm f2.8 coming out to replace the older one, we were very excited with the L badge that's now available. Of course, other than the improved in optics that we see in this lens, build quality was another issue that we were very concerned about. The lens actually, when picking it up, felt a little bit more plasticky than the other lenses that we're used to, for example, the 2470 2.8L that we use quite often. However, with the plasticky build, you also benefit from the lighter weight. The Canon EF 100mm f 2.8L macro lens allows you to shoot hands-free with up to four stops of image stabilization. Now this is very useful in hands-free. Right now I'm having the camera extended away from my body and I'm still achieving a fairly stable shot. As with all the newer L series lens, the EF 100mm f 2.8L lens features dust and water resistant seals. What this means is that you no longer have to worry about getting close to your subjects in the open while there is a light shower or rain. For anyone considering this 2.8L macro lens, the one thing they need to know is whether this is really worth the extra money over its non-L predecessor. Now sure, the non-L predecessor delivers tr tried and tested quality that is more than satisfactory. However, the key difference to the new one would be the image stabilization. With the hybrid image stabilization, not only do you benefit from the normal shakes, but also with the tilting, which is very pronounced when you're shooting macro handheld. So given that if you're gonna be shooting a lot of handheld macro shots with this camera, then investing extra into this L lens is definitely something that you will need to consider. And of course, the L lens means the red ring, which represents build quality, superior lens element, weather resistance, and a representative price tag. And yes, that means it's expensive.